Hi everyone, this is Rebecca Zung, divorce attorney here with you again today. And today's Thursday, that means it's time for Thursday Divorce Thoughts. Every day I come here and I give you uh, secrets and tips and tricks on how to get through your divorce. I spent nearly 20 years in the trenches and I've also been divorced once myself. So I've represented thousands of people in this and I've also gone through it. Uh, and so I think that qualifies me to give you some advice on what to do about your own divorce. And it is my pleasure to deliver this information to you on a daily basis. So today, today's topic is how to divorce with kids. Getting divorced is traumatic, period. But getting divorced with kids is just absolutely heartbreaking and heart-wrenching. And, but there are a few things that you can do to make it go a little bit more smoothly. Number one, before you separate, be, be sure to create some sort of parenting plan. It doesn't have to be the one that you live with forever. It can be considered a temporary parenting plan, but at least have something where you're addressing the day-to-day -day schedule and also specify the times and places for pickup and drop-off and also who's driving is are you the one who's getting the kids picks up the kids or something like that also number two do not under any circumstances discuss details of the divorce with the kids just assure them that they're still loved that they still will have both parents in their lives no matter what that the reasons for the divorce had nothing to do with them and just reassure them Remember that your children are half of the other person. So when you disparage your soon-to-be ex, you're disparaging your children, half of them. So they, they can't help but take it personally no matter what they say. So getting them on your side, having them be part of this whole thing, no matter how angry or resentful you are, is just the wrong thing to do. So get your support somewhere else and keep your feelings toward your ex to your, uh, away from your kids. Number three, figure out a way to communicate with your ex about the kids that will be in a way that's productive. Even if that means using a third party service that's monitored such as Our Family Wizard, whatever it takes to make sure that you're, you're using um, your communication in a way that's productive and, and for the best for the children. So those are my hot tips of the day. I give lots more information about how to deal with kids, parenting plans, child support in my core four plus kids modules. Uh, those are my private virtual divorce masterclasses. There's a lot more information about that at my website, breakingfreefromdivorce.com. You just go there and click on private presentation and uh, it'll take you right into the presentation about that. So my classes are designed to help you skip the hassle, save your fees, move on with your life, and you can check them out at breakingfreefromdivorce.com. Also, if you go to that website, you can click on where it says get my free book, and right now I'm offering a free copy of my best-selling divorce book, Breaking Free, a step-by-step -step divorce guide to achieving emotional, physical, and spiritual freedom and um, you just cover a small shipping and handling fee and relief and solutions are delivered right to your mailbox. So thanks for joining me today. Remember, I'm here every day. So if, you're, if you like this, please go head over to my YouTube channel and hit subscribe. And also uh, remember to go to breakingfreefromdivorce.com to find all those ways that I just mentioned on how to get support through this process. So I will see you tomorrow for Family Law Secrets Friday, where I will discuss how to deal with your abusive spouse. Until, remember, until then, remember this. You're just one step away from your new life. Together, we've got this.